Call of Duty is doomed. It is doomed. There's no way going around it. What's going on guys? Krahu here and first and foremost, big ups to my boy Zelgald for supplying this kick-ass gameplay. Thanks my man. Uh, some ICR action, so enjoy guys. Um, also, we are 10 signatures away from reaching 500 uh, signatures on my Medal of Honor campaign that will be in the description and also thank you uh, I'm guessing you guys enjoyed my Modern Warfare 2 live session I will do much more I will do on this weekend so I hope you're looking forward to it and if you missed it all three parts are also in the description hope that you guys are having a, a fun Friday so currently I really I mean I enjoy Black Ops 3 that's not you know that's not fresh news or whatever that's not uh, breaking news actually I do enjoy Black Ops 3. I, this game simply works. It's fun. It has its it has its really really good moments, but it also has shit like Splash. And I was never a fan. Just personally, I was never a fan of all those kitty maps. You know what I mean? Like such a Splash. I think it's ridiculous. It, it. I don't know. Maybe it's fun for some people. It has to be fun for some people. Somebody actually has to have Splash as their favorite fucking map. Has to. I personally don't like the style of it. Uh, this is wartime. Everything should be fucking sad and emo, goddammit. It's war! Of course, it's a video game. But me, personally, I, I just can't. I just can't deal with that shit. So, I had to make, like, do a double take. So, there's DLC 4 coming out for Black Ops 3. One of the maps is called... Micro. And I was just like... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the fuck is this? Is this like some bubblegum Katy Perry shit music video? What is happening? And indeed, it's like a miniature miniaturized version of, I guess, yourself going around a picnic table and you're fighting. Pavlos and shit. I mean, wraiths, sentry guns. On this. Sounds fun, right? Oh my god. I think it all started with Advanced Warfare's Ginger Man suit and. And all the other crazy shit that Advanced Warfare brought with itself. I just can't take it seriously. And that's one of the reasons why Call of Duty is, is doomed. It's losing or, or, or already lost its identity completely. Excuse me, that was like a little hiccup. The only thing that keeping Call of Duty... Call of Duty is the feel of the engine and simply the name. You give a gamer that stopped playing COD Black Ops 3 right now or Advanced Warfare... Let's say there was a person who stopped playing Call of Duty in after Black Ops 1. Okay, so after Black Ops 1. So no Black Ops 2, no Ghosts, none of that shit, no Advanced Warfare, no Black Ops 3. You give them your gingerbread man or your um, taunts, which are ridiculous in this game. Uh, I mean, they some of them are cool, but like the Nene -Nay shit and Gangnam style, that has no place in COD. That's just my opinion. Please don't call me a killjoy. I'm just a little bit old school like that. You give that player your controller and say, Here, here, bro, what is this game? And he doesn't see the title. He doesn't see the box, so he doesn't know what game he's playing. You put him straight in a fucking team deathmatch on Splash. What is he going to say? Is this a mod or, or, or something? Now, Counter-Strike... Shit, now I don't remember. Counter-Strike 1.6 or Source... I can't remember now, they did have a mod where you were like miniature and I did play it and you're like running around the kitchen and blah 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 but this is just ridiculous and Counter-Strike did it in like 2001 or 2000 um, this is just absolutely ridiculous, go go check it out, check out Charlie Intel look at all the maps, the other maps look fine, like there's this one map, I I can't distinguish it now ooh, they, and they are remaking uh, Outskirts from World at War, that's fantastic Outskirts was one of my favorite maps in World at War, and that map is going to to be called Rupture. So not only am I going to get the DLC 4 just to check out the insanity that is this, this fucking micro map, which I know immediately I'm not gonna like, but I'm getting it for Rupture and the other uh, three maps, Citadel and, and Outlaw. They look great, like Outlaw has this good... It kind of reminds me of Warhawk from the, from the screen, uh, I hope I'm... I'm I hope I'm talking about the correct one. Uh, Warhack was a great map in Call of Duty Ghosts. Um, so hopefully those maps will play good. DLC 3 maps. I think the winners of the DLC um, season for Black Ops 3 will be DLC 4 and DLC 2. 
Although, I don't know. I'm more used to DLC 1 just because... I don't know, it was the thing to get and then I only got the DLC afterwards to perhaps get gameplay and play zombies and whatever. So again, zombies look solid. And now we have Advanced Warfare, uh, Advanced Warfare, Infinite Warfare, um, bringing us those crazy zombie adventure 80s style... W what? Why is Infinity Ward even touching zombies? Zombies... Leave that shit to Treyarch, okay? Leave that shit to Treyarch. Why is Infinity Ward dipping its toes into zombies? I am almost 100% sure that Activision told them to. I mean, it had to be like that. Maybe they wanted to continue Extinction. Maybe they wanted to do Spec Ops. Although, Spec Ops in Modern Warfare 3 was shit. In Modern Warfare 2, it made sense, it was good, it was great. It got all them goddamn stars. It was very, very fun and awesome music, awesome soundtrack in that, by the way. Uh, later on, it got kind of cheesy in Modern Warfare 3. And then, of course, we had Extinction and Call of Duty Ghost, which some people liked. It's a, I guess it, it has to be a cult classic because they're not releasing Ghosts. They want to franchise Infinite Warfare. They want to make Infinite Warfare 1, 2, 3. So I'm going to be like 30 years or, or 29. I'm going to be 29 when... Um, Infinite Infinity Ward re releases their next Call of Duty or whatever, and it's probably going to be goddamn Infinite Warfare 2. Fuck. <laughs> That's interesting. Uh, they also talked about, I don't know if this was kind of an unintentional, unintentional spoiler or whatever on Infinity Ward's part, but when they were talking about franchising, they were talking about franchising like Treyarch did it, and then they said Sledgehammer did it. Hmm. So, Advanced Warfare two next year right anyway uh hopefully that's not gonna happen um so that's just my take that that's why i believe call of duty is doomed or rather the call of duty identity is doomed i don't like what's happening with all those maps you know simple stuff like that is just what takes me out of the game you know like uh, out of the gaming experience as far as call of duty is concerned like some of those classic maps i don't know if call of duty 4 remastered is going to be enough to bring people's uh, interest back into this series, we shall see. At the end of the day, we can just put videos and comments on, on, on YouTube and they either listen to us or they do their own thing. Whatever. Tell me what you guys think in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, be sure to check out the description. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed. This is Krahu and I will see you guys next time. Take care.